Welcome to The Daily Bid, your source for the most interesting items in upcoming auctions. My name is Devontae Chisholm, and did you know that Valentine's Day dates back all the way to the 5th century? There are many stories to explain this day of romance, including St. Valentine, who was imprisoned in ancient Rome for secretly performing weddings for soldiers who were forbidden to marry. As the story goes, before his execution, he wrote a letter to the young daughter of his jailer, who he had fallen in love with, and signed it, Your Valentine. With this tragic love story as a backdrop, we take a look at famous star-crossed lovers and the valuable antique Valentine's Day gifts that they may have given each other. We have several portraits of Romeo and Juliet to show you. The first is this limited edition lithograph with signature by Marc Chagall. And in this pair of portraits, the Juliet on the left is wearing a string of pearls in her hair. If Romeo gave these pearls to Juliet, it would have been a major statement of his love and commitment. Pearls similar to Juliet's are available through live auctioneers right now with the starting bid of $500. The picture on the right shows a younger Juliet, keeping with Shakespeare's original story where Juliet is only 13 years old. She is also wearing a necklace of red pearl-shaped beads, possibly given to her by Romeo. A Chinese red hard stone necklace like the one Juliet is wearing in the portrait is available with a starting bid of $100. In 1840, the great love between Queen Victoria and her husband Albert ushered in what is known as the Romantic Period, a period that abruptly ended when Albert died and Victoria went into 27 years of mourning known for its grand jewelry styles adorned with dark stones like onyx and jet. For Valentine's Day, keeping up with the fashion of the time, he may have given her this gorgeously romantic early Victorian garnet and pearl necklace with a starting bid of 2,400 pounds, along with the Valentine's Day card like this Victorian paper cutout with a starting bid of $30. Third is Edward and Mrs. Simpson. King Edward VIII's love for American socialite Wallace Simpson ran so deeply that he was willing to give up the throne of England after his desire to marry a twice-divorced woman caused a constitutional crisis in the United Kingdom. Because of this, King Edward may have given her a discreet gift, like a delicate Edwardian pearl and amethyst necklace, and she may have given him an Edwardian silver and glass inkwell. Remember, you can bid on all these items and a lot more over at liveauctioneers.com. Don't forget to give this video a like and subscribe for more of the daily bid every Monday through Friday. You can click right over here to check out some of our other videos and comment down below letting us know what you want to see us cover in the future. As always, happy bidding.